Okay, we're going to do one more hour of this, which is a really bad idea. Because when you stop and think about it for any small amount of time, you realize that I'm running on fumes here. And, uh, we, we, we still got shit reception through Twitch. And I don't know if it's on my end anymore. But, um, I'm also at the pixel hunt stage of the game, so that. But let's get right back into it anyway. This is pure, like, maybe he's got some sherry in his trunk. Nope! He grabbed his coat and left. Maybe he's got some sherry in his glove compartment. He he doesn't. He doesn't have sherry in his glove compartment. Maybe, maybe there's some sherry out in... I, I don't know what I'm doing anymore. That's the problem. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. Yeah, fuck logic. What has logic ever done for me? Stupid logic. And it's four axioms. Who needs four axioms? I'm pretty sure there's a magnet on top of this tower, so let's go ahead and try that out. You're probably thinking the same thing I am. Why isn't there a bottle of sherry up here? Okay, what's next on the map? Bedard? That cave. That cave. Let's take a closer look at that cave. Maybe we'll find some sherry wine in there. So we go here, we take a right until we get our first right. Um. I mean, it makes sense, but like, what knocked over the tree? You will need clothes to go to the go to the general store. There's no clothes in the general store. We've been all over the general store, but I do want to take a closer look at that cave. Is the thing? Wee! Whoa! 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 whoa. And it's on the way to the general store, you know? Shotgun has the coat. Yep, that's true. Uh, I believe his name was Old Rosary or something like that. Something funky like that. Also, did we ever stop and take a look at that sign? When we saw the sign, did it open up our eyes? What, what was... Maybe it'll tell you, oh, this, the name of this town that we're in anyway. Or is this just Edimepec? The Great Lake. Something, you missed something in the general store, you bet. Alright. Uh, Manistan. Well, it was in the beginning. Right? So, it is conceivable that I screwed up and missed something. I'm not just wandering into the woods, I'm just figuring if I were going to hide something, I'd hide it near this, uh, near this sign. Um, tree, get out of my way. 
right, the tree needs to move, not me. All right. So the first stop of our little tour has been finished, and now let's go ahead and head to that cave. Don't worry, we'll get to the general store. I just, I just want to get to that cave. Oh, no, that's, that's Roy's place. Whoa! Whoa, that was close there, buddy. Now, last time we stopped here, we kind of found a map. Yep. Whoa. Okay, there should not be anything here. Is this Lachette's place? It is, isn't it? Or Giles Lachette, wasn't it? Let's see if my memory is... Yeah, Lachance, not Lachette. Well, it doesn't matter. His place just happens to be in the way. Run off into the woods like wild men. Wild men with hogs. Delicious hogs. Hogs. I didn't bring a. I didn't. I didn't bring a log with me, and I'm carrying a filled gas can. Okay, okay. Let's run back away and it to our truck like wild men with hogs with trucks, and leave behind the gas can and grab some wood. Yeah, we no longer need this hardware. I don't think we're gonna need the piercers or the hammer. Or the pliers. I'll come back if I need the pliers. We don't need the empty bottles just yet. Well, we will come back for those, but I'm just kinda... S and the axe I'm keeping, and I want a log for logs sake. Wow, there are 13 logs in our truck. Damn, man. We're log hogs. There's an X over there. Okay, off to eat and do tree things. Bye. Okay. See you, Lacuna. Thanks, or... Yeah, you changed your name, Blue. But anyway, thank you for uh, showing up. Spending a little bit of your day with me. I appreciate it. This is the cave, isn't it? Yeah, this is the cave. It's fucking... Dynamite?! I can see that there's still a lot more to unlock in this game. I just don't want this to be one of those stupid points where, like, something is obvious to me and I don't know how to deal with it. So, okay, we're at Lachance's Le place, and I guess we're heading, heading to the general store after this. But I want to take one more look at Lachance's place. See if I missed anything. Like, for example, did I check his trash already? I probably did. I'm a good trio of raccoons. I'm a good trash panda, so. I go warm up. We're about to go through this place. Is there no light switch here? Here's one. Hey, there we go. Uh, Looks like the holes in that puzzle are there to stay. Mm -hmm. More logs to steal. Lady. What's this? Oh no, it's just a empty jar. 
I like how the curtain froze into place too. Hi Queenie. Oh, more meat. Steal that. The pot was cold, and the stew inside wasn't cooked. It's likely that poor Giselle was slow cooking it before she got snapped. Hmm. What a waste. Friend killers. Unpack box just moved here. Oh, hey, that works. A repainting, huh? Do they happen to have a magnet in one of the cabinets? Just checking. We've already opened this. There's nothing in there now. Many boxes scattered about. Carl didn't need to summon his detective training to quickly figure that the Lachances had just moved in. Many boxes scattered about. Gosh. Carl didn't need to summon his detective training to quickly figure that the Lachances had just moved in. A nice white coating would restore the room to its charm of olden days. Huh. Mounty's hat. I don't actually know what those are called. Like, it's not a cowboy hat. Those are Stetsons. Okay. General store time. Check out the general store. First and foremost, I think I want to check the garage to the general store. Because I just combed over... You know what? Steal their mail. Eh, there's a letter. To Mr. Giles Lachance in South Manistan. Dear Mr. Lachance, we have carefully taken note of your complaint regarding the complaint uh, the collapse of the natural cave on your property. However, given the absence of actual damage or injury, we cannot move forward with this investigation. The natural cave cannot be considered a personal belonging. Furthermore, your claim regarding the landslide cause it caused by work due to the DW Inc. mine seems outlandish. As the mine is miles away from your property, also it's imperative that you secure your property as you would be held accountable for any injuries caused by the steep terrain. This is where Crying Wolf leads you. Ugh. Sincerely, Pierre Valjean, register uh, something of Quebec. I'm sorry, Quebec. I'm not a native. Vroom, vroom, vroom. Okay. I check that truck and that sign. Let's see what we got. Lake Edamapec. I have checked this sign. Oh, just some rocks. And I think I have checked this truck. Uh, 
It's just crashed on the side of the road. A little bit closer to the general store. See, it only took me 15 minutes to get here, but I got here eventually. Oh my goodness, that's right. Hang on. Yeah. Door Ghost will take care of that for me. Nice and warmed up here. Okay. Let's see here. Turn off the switch. Turn the generator. It's already on the generator. We need to turn off the store and turn on the garage. And okay, let's check out the garage again. What we got around here? Cleaning supplies, some kind of garbage. off a light hmm. well, we know it's for Jilly. I think I have been here, and I don't see anything that's popping out to me. Ho, ho, ho. I think this car now has a machine gun. Okay, no. So that didn't yield me anything. I don't know if I would call that wasted time, though. Okay. Turn off the garage. And there the we go. The note explained that the garage and the store couldn't be supplied with electricity at the same time. Yeah. Take that federal property. Hmm. No pins on this map. Didn't even travel half the province of Quebec. I always wondered why they have these maps. Hey, Doom Lad. Have you made much progress? Well, we got shot at. And, uh, oh, I got this axe. And, um, no, no, we're, we are now stuck. We're looking for a bottle of sherry so that we can make super wine so that we can get a coat. We are also looking for, um, treads from something so that we can fix a ski thing. And we also need a magnet. So we're, we're actually missing specific things now. We're, we have visited every place on the map that I know of. Go behind the counter. I am behind the counter months. However, that said, let's go ahead and check these out again. So right now we're playing cleanup, Doom Lad. We're, we're hoping that there's something that I missed. Let's see, matches, they're all empty. Nothing, pencil. Uh, sawdust. This is where they keep their sawdust. And an ashtray. What about down here? 
Um, shut up. Uh, this is the beer. This is Maxim House. And Sansa Coffee. Hmm. Grab that. Anything else? Can I grab these skizzers? No. Hi? I mean, maybe. Um. Where am I going? Oh, hey! Alright, month. You got me. I missed out on a bottle of sherry. So, okay. With that done, uh, let's go ahead and hightail it out of here. And finish this sort of subquest line. So, our next stop, um, making white lightning caribou wine thing. There we go, time for driving. Driving a truck, driving a big old truck. Pedal to the metal, hope I don't run out of luck. I'll be driving this 16 wheel, well, I guess it's not 16 wheel, until the break of dawn. Driving a truck with my high heels on. You bet he'll be frozen when I reach him? Well, that'll leave more caribou for me. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm a danger to myself and society. Caribou wine. Ah, right, here we go. Whoa, that's called a fence. Damn it. I don't know. I've, I've flubbered that up pretty good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Turn radius on this thing is pretty terrible. Okay. We're gonna need an empty bottle. We've already got the white lightning and the sherry. Let's get some caribou. That fence will never hurt anyone again. So you say that. But then it broke my heart. Alright. Let's do this. We now have a bottle of caribou. Does it have a description? Uh. Oh, here it is. It doesn't have a description, I don't think. Alright, let's go see that old man and... Please, God, don't let him be dead, because even though he was annoying, he was the only living person we'd ever seen, and he had a very, like, old old Canadian charm about him. So... From Canada. Alright. And if we're really lucky, he won't shoot at us again. Whoa! Oh yeah, <laughs> snow driving. I know how to drive in snow. I'm a good driver, goddammit! I know what I'm doing! I'm hoping to go into that uh, ice cave and find some... Uh, find some dynamite we can blow up the other ice cave, and inside we'll find a magnet that we can tie some string to, and that, str that string and a magnet can get a key. And with that key, we'll open up a shack. And the shack will get us, by God, something. <laughs> Alright, here we go. 
It's old Rosary's house. Rosie's? Rosary's? I think it's Rosary's. Rosaires. It's Rosaires. I don't know. French is uh, is not a good language for me. So, all right. One thing I've definitely learned from this guy. Hey, you're alive. Yeah, I, I got you. I got you. Your shit. You go, old man. Quand on cherche, on trouve. Parce que je t'aime bien, Aster, je vais te dire quelque chose. Ok, tell me something. Je vais te prendre ma pénis. Parce que par là-bas, tu vas rencontrer le vrai froid. Yeah, I agree. Le froid qui glace comme t'en as jamais connu dans ta vie. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> Winter is coming. Alright. New journal entry. Give me a second. Uh, so you're gonna make fun of me while I'm doing stuff. Like further north is where it is. Boom! Got a warm coat. Yes. Uh, so what is left? Treads. I need a treads. Not an old man, a bit mad in exchange for caribou. An unacceptable drink or an unpalatable drink. He gave me a coat. All right. So need guns. Need to get rid of the big wall. I need a tread. There's still much to do, I guess. Whoa, is this you, old man? Ah, oh, la belle pétarade. En 17 que c'était. Et le Kaiser, il se souvient de moi avec ma belle carabine. Bang, bang, que je lui disais. Bang, bang, bang. Ah, le bon temps. Who says bang bang unironically? Dans mon temps, c'était comme sur l'image. On était vrai, fier, fort, puis on avait le bon lieu de notre bord. Looks like they're going over a waterfall. Well, thank you very much, old man. It is time to check out that cave now, I guess. Finally out of my bikini. Yarp. Yarp. Feels good, man. We need to get our own bang bang. I'm glad the old man was still alive. Going to sleep? Alright, month. Thanks for hanging around for so long. I know it's like really early in the morning right now where you are, so. You get some good rest, man. Sleep the rest of the just. Alright. Now, before I go in there, I need to make sure that I have a log. I do. Let's go. Hey, wait a second. Snowmobile key. That's right. Okay. That's fine. Okay. Hoping for some place to warm up around here first, like save. That'd be nifty if that happened. No? No. Well, that's gonna make it awkward if I die, so I guess I just won't do that.
This is probably a bad idea. Luckily, he had the coat to protect him from the biting cold. Your mama's a coat. Yo mama's so fat that she's got a real high risk for diabetes and we're all very worried about her health. Um, I don't see anything down there, but I see something over here. So why don't we start over here? Follow the right wall. Yeah, I'm actually doing pretty good on heat. Maybe not brain power. Let's do something about that. Yeah, like beer. And, uh, you know, what the hell? Let's take a pill. All right. All right, we're continuing to follow the beast, I guess. Hello? Hey, what's up there, uh, melting dog? Don't worry, melting dog, I'll save you. Hmm. Okay, well, back to the truck I go, I guess. Is this really where I need to go now? Yep. I need a hammer and some hardware. And just for fun, let's kind of explore this place. Let's see what's going on around here. Matches and fire starter. Thick, yeah. There's the hardware, but no hammer. There's a hammer. Well, I mean, like, fucking ask and thou shalt receive. Okay, so I just went around in a circle. That's fine. There we go. Makes me wonder about that magnet. I'm magical. Still going the right way. Oh, shit. What happened to you? Another instance of this magic ice. What was this one doing? Lying on the ground. So afraid. The plot thickened like water into ice. It was crawling. This usually goes backwards, but not this time. No, he ran this way. He had been running in fear from something creeping towards him, against which he couldn't do anything, only to end up like this, petrified and cold. He wasn't walking that way, he was backing up that way. What was he running from? The 
Wendigo? Whoa, I didn't even notice this. He tried to fire a gun. Okay, he succeeded in firing a gun. Now that didn't work out good for him. His hand's right here. Whatever he saw, he found in this place. I need another log. What were you doing? You were putting up a defense against something. Okay, I can't read like this. Thank you. It seemed as though Regin had been ready to take up arms and slay people like Hamilton. So that's Regin. Could he have committed murder for his cause? Who could have gotten killed in front of his very eyes? Old Rosary told me that the mine administrators were having us on, and that the mines from before the war were neither collapsed nor inaccessible. Well, as usual, the old man was right. Those damn English people keep lying to us every damn day because we're just damn slaves to them. Water boys. White negroes. I'm a little uncomfortable. Like Valerie said, we'll see who the damn slaves are by the end of the damn year. I'll set up the heart of my government in those mines. The resistance. Watch out, fat cats. I'm putting damn bayonets in our cannons. Wait, what? <laughs> Roll the cannons closer. I want to stab them with the tip. August, 1970. The English tell us the region is full of resources. The resources they're forgetting about is our seniors. It's full of old people around here, and they've got plenty of resources. Old Man Rosary in exchange for a full load of bottles of caribou a day. Damn, man. <laughs> Put us in contact with the best country, the best our country has to offer. Veterans, hunters, the salt of the earth, I'm telling you. These people have shotguns upon shotguns. I mean, fuck snipers. I mean, we got shotguns. <laughs> what am I doing there? Because, you know, shotguns are not long range. And you should know that. You're a hunter. You... Where, was, where was I? I lost it. Shotguns upon shotguns. <laughs> In blinds all over the territory. They agree to lay, lend me some. Pretty much no questions asked. I still told them a big fat cat hunt was in the works. God, I'm tired. I also told them our aim was to make sure there are not a damn one of them left from here to the Ottawa's rivers. Oh, God, there's more. September 1st, 1970. It's even better than I thought. The damn guns aren't old-timey relics from the Great War. There are modern, semi-automatic weapons in there, too. Dynamite stolen from the mining sites after closing. All I need now is a militia to bear these arms and kick the English out of our land. I'm wondering who the savages will back up. I have faith that they will help us and not them. Taking back their land is a matter of principle for them. September 4th, 1970. God damn it. Guile Giles, Giles, Giles has no balls. I was aware of that before bringing him into my project, but it's so insulting to be em emasculated like that. He told me in his wimpy voice that he has some something to blackmail Big Hamilton with. What's the point of blackmailing him when we could just blow his head off? I would have been better off speaking with his wife, Giselle. Now she's something, that woman. She could hold her own with a shotgun. Besides, everyone knows she's the one who wears the pants in that couple. Lamoth has given up too, that coward. On the other hand, the Lamoths, they're just not serious enough. They have a few screws loose. You can't start a revolution with the with crazy people. Um, but you're... Pierre, I know you would have been on my side. You would have been a lieutenant in my army. Rest in peace. Eaten by wolves. Not an easy way to kick the bucket. 
Some people in the village say that you brought this on yourself by poaching those wolves, and that the end... I really am pushing it, aren't I? That in the end, they just brought you to justice in their own way. There will be a monument in your name in my new Quebec. I will have the I will have to free Manistan region all by myself. Alexandre Blas didn't appreciate it when I baited him by praising his brother. That guy hasn't cha has changed since Pierre was found. He's been miserable. I've tried talking to him about it, but that big Ulf only only punched the miner that made his hand bleed. Oh, made punched the mirror and that made his hand bleed. Oh, that's what the broken mirror was about. Oh. Oh, okay, that makes sense. I'll give freedom to my country without those tender-hearted folks. They'll thank me later. What happened last night was horrible. I'd never seen someone die like that right next to me. I felt sick. So much blood. I was... I'm wondering if the revolution is really for me after all. Seems to have made some modifications. I mean, like... Don't mind if I do. Never know when you need that. Ooh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, warm the hell up. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's see what else we can find around here. Wow, I am dropping frames left and right now. Cool. Alright, good times. This will be the last episode tonight, I think. Mm. This is where he was living. Why sleep at home when you can sleep in a cave? Potatoes. Some ammo. A leaf end rifle. Which I need to see this equipment. Tin ammunition. What kind of ammunition am I using here? 303 ammo. Alright, alright. So that takes care of the weapon. Of those SIGs. Some coffee, some cans. No magnets. Shit monkeys. Oh, uh, how about no? Not. Mind powers. Frame rate is good now? Okay, good. I, I really am kind of pushing it, really. Friday night's quite the stream night for Twitch, and uh, uh, I realize I didn't stream the rest of the week, uh, what with my declining mental health, but, um, y you know, uh, I just wanted to squeeze in some more episodes and build up a backlog. I might stream tomorrow, but... Ice seemed to take over this place like mold. Isn't there? That wall wasn't there earlier. How was he going to get out of here? Mm. With dynamite! Ha ha! Just walk on that fire there route in there. I think the dynamite might be the best option, but do I really want to set off dynamite in a cave? Yes. Yes, I do. Let's do it. Keep healthy? <laughs> that, wasn't, that wasn't high on my priorities a while back. I'm a lot better now, though. Uh, oh, 
Oh, good. Run! That's far enough, right? I'm sure that's far enough. That's fine. Yeah, TNT plus cave is always a good idea. Uh, the ice, oddly, did not budge despite the powerful fiery blast. Something was definitely rotten in this place. How could it be rotten when it's perfectly preserved in ice? We've been trapped here by, I guess, the Wendigo or something. Alright, let's, uh... Let's try some Fatal Frame action here and see if we can't figure it out that way. Oh look, it's a picture of a wall. Hmm. We... Did we break some stuff down here? I'm hoping. No. Do a quick warm up, because we're about to go right back upstairs. Map doesn't tell me much, but that's okay. Uh oh. visit that one guy again. Carl suddenly felt observed. He was worried about a presence around him. I I'm sure it'll be fine. It's fine. This isn't something you have to worry about. Oh, uh. I mean, cool. Uh, next time we'll come up with witty one liners. This looks like it might be better used for dynamite. Ah, uh, move! That should be far enough, right? I need to keep one left. Hello? When, when did it become very night? Oh my goodness. Where, where even am I? Huh. Actually closer to the car than I thought I'd be. Well, it's night now, and shit gets all creepified at night time. So... I need to go this way. This isn't a perfect situation, you understand. I think I see the headlights of my truck. Yarp.
Sure, glowing ice. Uh, I've seen weirder things today. I want to withdraw my bullets. And... I, I, do I have a log on me? I should probably get rid of the log if I have one. How heavy is that gun? Eh, it's got some weight. I don't need all this meat. Just like some of the meat. Just that much. This is just for now, you understand. I don't need this hammer. That or that. I don't need the empty bottle anymore. Okay, that's pretty good. Now the question comes, where to next? Where did we need dynamite? We need a dynamite somewhere. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We need dynamite on the other cave on the opposite end. Ah, oh, for crying out loud, this has gone very bad. Blow up the ice wall? Well, we've already proven that Blowing up the ice wall won't actually work. Loading. That was fucking creepy. Old Man Rosary is alright. Alright, there we go. God, that was a long way around a short trip. Um. Please keep playing your music, because you're the only thing that's reminding me that... I'm not alone out in this world. He knows how to shoot first. That is true. Okay. Why is my not why is my radio not playing? There we go. Right. Um, music? I'd like a little help, music, please. Thank you. Scoot around here. Okay, I need to check my map real quick. Um. Uh, okay. Okay. It is the first left. Salon. That wasn't it. This is it! Oh, God, it was it! I hate driving in snow! Take it, attack it, take it, attack it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, there's the... Oh, uh, is that a burning house? What?
All right. Uh, so, so there's a lot here that I don't like. And uh, before we go explore the mysteries of the cave, first, obviously, we're going to save in here. But um, I think with it saved right here, I'm going to call this a night. So let me make sure that save game and yeah yeah shit's got spooky all you really had to do was turn off the sun and suddenly this turns into a much spookier experience uh before I go we're gonna Stealing all your logs. And that's how the logs are stolen. Okay, um. Okay. So let's call it good there. There we go. And... Okay. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for tuning in tonight. Uh, Doom Lad, thank you very much. Month, if you're seeing this video, because I know you're asleep, thank you for showing up. Blue Lacuna, I love you, sis. Everybody else, anybody lurking in the background, anybody who finds this on YouTube, thanks for showing up. All right, I'm calling it good. You guys have a great night, and I'll see you whenever.